Okay, so we're here with Jake at RYK Modular. Afternoon. Uh, Jake, what have you brought to Synthfest 2024? Uh, today we've got the new Algo module, which launched earlier in the summer, um, which is uh, four operator FM or quad complex oscillator, as you will. So we have a frequency control here, and then a, a modulation oscillator here going into the carrier. So I can adjust the frequencies there. There's another one. You can turn up the amount of cross modulation. And then we've also got um, over here we've got a prototype module of a new uh, quad envelope which we're bringing out later this year. Excellent. So we have four channels of envelopes so we get A, D, S, R for each channel like this. So they're all being triggered by the sequence at the moment so we've got four envelopes going into the modulation inputs of the algo. So each oscillator on algo has its own level control with an envelope. Amazing. Um, and this is quite fun so we can have uh, we can do knob recording as well, so we can add some uh, animation to the envelope there where the release time is getting modulated. Beautiful. It seems to be so uh, such a fast refresh rate, it's so, so um, smoothly animated. Well, in the world of envelopes, you've got to be fast, you know? you've got to be snappy. Or well, not a snappy, who knows. Um, <laughs> and it's got a sort of more complex uh, option here, we have an option button. So we go from red to a green mode and the green mode allows you to use modulation inputs to modulate things like time, uh, level of, of the um, envelope, ADSR characteristics. There's an antenna verger for the modulation input. We can change the slope of the envelope from exponential to linear to cosine, sine, and uh, sort of pulsed version. So like an on-off binary waveform. And also there's antenna for the output. So all the envelopes can be um, plus or minus envelopes and then if they're in LFO mode they can be unipolar or bipolar so you, you can actually change the level of the output so you don't need an antenna verge on an input of another module incredibly really helps and am I right in thinking am I right in thinking that the the red here indicates the connection between the the two oscillators that's right yeah sorry I didn't uh, talk about that so if you look at the um, the red button so start if we start off here so now I've just chosen uh, an algorithm where there's no connections between the oscillators, so each oscillator has its own vo um, frequency and level control. So it's essentially four oscillators. And then if I use the algo algorithm button, we can make connections between the um, oscillators here. So let's do a quick example. So this becomes a modulator, and this is a carrier, so if I turn up the level, we get that complex oscillation going from one oscillator to another. And of course there's another one here. And we can go through different algorithms. So we're here we have one modulator, three carriers. So I can turn up the modulator oscillator. And of course you can use a CV for overall modulation amount. Or you can use the oscillator's input with an LFO or an envelope to control the amount of modulation index. So you get nine different uh, algorithms in all. Uh, there's also a chorus, a lovely built-in chorus. So we can do quite a nice sort of 80s style stuff. So 
you can use it for drones too, it doesn't have to be just a sort of FM percussion or bass line machine. And would you, could you also use it in tandem with your new module in this drone mode? Yeah, so we could use, so this module, the quad envelope, you can also use as LFOs. So I could set up one of the, one of the channels there as a, a little LFO. So then you can see that's that uh, in LFO mode is then controlling the level of this modulated oscillator. So we get a nice pulsing sort of sound there. It's got an incredibly rich sound to it. Thank you. And we could feed another one in over here, I guess. Uh, what's that one? There you go. Amazing. And do you have any kind of uh, date in mind for release of, of your new module? Yeah, so the quad envelope would be probably hopefully the end of this year. Uh, Touchwood. So maybe December, I think. And uh, the, FM, the FM synth is available now. Yeah, so this, we sort of launched it in the summer and it's been uh, selling really well this summer and carrying on. So uh, yeah, it's been really popular. But I think now that we've got our own envelope, it's going to be really useful having these two as a sort of set. So you've got modulation for every oscillator on the, on the so you can use it properly for FM duties. Mm. Well, they sound incredible. They look marvellous. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much for showing us.